Hey, there we go. <laughs> What's up everyone, it's Mike Dawes here, the Acoustic Guitar Guy. Happy New Year and welcome to this video, the subject of which is learning guitar. Now, when I was learning guitar back in the early 2000s, I was limited to what my guitar teacher had in his paper book. I would go to him and we'd say, which song should we look at today? Fast forward to the mid 2000s, we had access to not only the songs, but also every influence under the sun. We had access to musicians from all over the planet, not just our guitar teachers paper book. However, now in the year 2024, not only do we have access to all of those influences and songs, but we have access to incredible learning methods that we can fit literally in our pocket. And that is the subject of today's video, which is sponsored by Ubisoft and the wonderful learning platform Rocksmith Plus, which not only features a desktop version, but also an app on the mobile phone, which we are going to look at today. So are you ready to watch me make an absolute fool of myself using AI generated feedback and gamified guitar learning techniques? Well, let's take a look at Rocksmith Plus. Now we're all familiar with Ubisoft. I actually had the good fortune of tracking some guitars for the new Prince of Persia game, so do check that out, as well as the free trial in the video description. So what is Rocksmith Plus? Well, it's essentially a relatively new and innovative interface to help you visually learn a musical instrument. What we have here is a translucent horizontal guitar neck cross-referenced with a noteway that brings colored and numbered blocks towards the player. Once these blocks connect with the corresponding string, that's when you play the note. If you've ever played any rhythm game before, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Now, this is actually streaming these songs from the cloud, and there's over 7,500 songs included at the moment. Coldplay, Paramore, Muse, big heavy hitters. Wow, it's got the whole of Dookie on here. That's like my first album I ever bought. Rocksmith Plus for 2024 have a 60-day challenge to try and encourage people to learn a musical instrument. Honestly, as New Year's resolutions Go. It's a pretty great one to have. Beats going to the gym. Now, I was really curious to see how it would pick up my guitar without any cabling attached. This is actually using the iPhone's built in microphone. Right here, there's very basic instructions on how to make some noise from your guitar and check the level. We have a noise reduction program that it starts, so it listens to your room in order to hear your guitar in the most efficient way. Let's start that. So, now let's see how the iPhone mic can pick up my guitar and tune. Let's see how accurate it is. This is very, very cool indeed. It's prompting me to play the specific string, which is color coded. And it's hearing if I'm in tune. Now, the first thing I wanted to show you was how we can use the practice exercises here to get to grips with the interface itself. So let's open up the exercises and start with something very, very basic here. What's going to happen is numbers and colors are going to come at us in time with the beat, just like this. One hundred percent. Look out, Buckethead. So I think it's time to play a song. I'm feeling less than confident. We're going to try some Misery Business by Paramore now. Now, although I know the song, I've never learnt the song. So this will be a lot of fun. Now you can see it's asking me to tune to drop D flat now. But the tune is pretty accurate. All right, let's give it a go. So it looks like we're down on the bottom few frets here. Yep. And then open is it? Yep. Okay. Okay, same but muted. The lit up bits are probably staccato. Yep, staccato. Okay, up to A flat. Amazing. This feels so good. We've got to give Master of Puppets a go. Come on, back to E standard. All right, full disclosure, I, I played Master of Puppets when I was at school, but that was about 20 years ago. So let's see if the down picking still has it. <laughs> it doesn't still have it. Really cool feature about this is there's a riff repeater, which means you can actually learn the songs by repeating sections very, very slowly. So let's just take that fast riff at the beginning. Seeing everything slowed down is insanely helpful. Ooh, I just leveled up. Okay, we gotta get beautiful now and uh, delve into the sync monster that is chasing cars. Now, there isn't that many notes in the song as far as I recall, so I've stuck it at 100%. Let's take a little look. Yep. Almost. Open. Now, isn't it? If I lay here, 
A power chord. What a great song. 92% on Chasing Cars. That's the one to beat. That is an excellent first song for anyone starting on Rocksmith Plus. Looks like we've got a classic four chord song here. We've got uh, an A flat, so fourth fret shape here like this. We've got the, the sixth fret B flat minor. We've got the D flat and we've got the G flat like this. Okay, I'm used to playing those chords, but uh, all the tutorials are there for you guys to play them if you don't. So let's give this a go, but let me see what happens when I change the difficulty all the way. 4%, 4% of the notes in the song. I'm not too familiar with this song, although I'm sure I'll recognize it once it starts playing. Riptide, Vance Joy, four chord song, standard tuning. Here we go. Nice clean tone. Sixth fret to begin with. Oh, I've got time here. Coffee. Oh, no. Cheers. Two notes this time. Um, oh, ten? Let's try it a little bit more complicated. 27%, okay? Outlining the chords. This is super fun. Let's try Basket Case by Green Day. Now, I'm gonna set the difficulty pretty low at about sort of 50, 50 something percent, just so it gives us less notes to play. This is the core idea of Rocksmith Plus for absolute beginners to begin with and slowly slide up that progression. I think it's gonna be quite hard for me to not play all of the notes in the right hand, but let's have a laugh with this one. See, it's not giving me all of the notes, just some, okay. I am one of those. Let's try basket case 100%. Let's see what happens. Hopefully this will be more familiar in the right hand. Now something I noticed before is because we're tuned flat, the chord names that are coming up don't really correspond with what I recognize as specific fret locations. So this time I'm going to try and focus on the numbers and that's going to hopefully keep me locked into the position I'm supposed to be in. Okay. If I'm over 70%, I'll be really, really happy with that. Thank you very much. All right, your accuracy improved. 87%. All right, well, that was a lot of fun, wasn't it? That's Rocksmith Plus, the iOS version available for PC and iPad as well. Obviously, there's so much stuff we didn't get into today. There's lots of lessons. There's lots of customization options. There's obviously a reason why 5 million people have already signed up for this, you know. Thanks very much, folks. Don't forget to check out the link in the description to the free trial to Rocksmith Plus. Thanks to Ubisoft for sponsoring the video. And do check out the new Prince of Persia game, which I play a little bit of guitar on. I'll be out on tour this year in Italy and the rest of Europe, as well as the USA, a whole bunch, and the UK in March as well. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel where the announcement for my next studio album is coming very soon, as well as many new music videos. Take care and enjoy Rocksmith Plus. Cheers.